and this GP does, I visit the Kitwanga General Store and talk to my cousin Tees Jarzma about the trials and tribulations of running your own business in a small town. Kitwanga General Store is a family-run business that my wife and I uh, purchased just over seven years ago. Uh, I was originally constructed in its current location in 1973-74. At that time there was no bridge over the Skeena River, so it was a true general store to a much larger community than we have now. Uh, it, uh, in the valley here, the villages have in the meantime grown quite a bit, both uh, Gitniao and Gitwangak. And uh, they, along with Gitagukla, thanks to the bridge, are our main customer base right now. So. Although if you pull into Kitwanga, it looks like there's nothing here. Um, that's where our customers come from. If you've never been to the Kitwanga General Store, I've asked Tees how you may find it on your own. The best idea is, I guess, uh, at the junction, which the petrol can, uh, of junction of 37 and Highway 16. Uh, most people think of that that aren't familiar with the area as Kitwanga, but there's a whole lot more. If you go across the bridge, across the tracks, up the hill, and uh, turn left at the top of the straight stretch at the end of the hill. Before owning the store, Tees was a senior planerman, and buying a store was never in the original plan. Uh, I spent 25 years working in a sawmill, and uh, when they shut down uh, at that time, they've since been reincarnated under a new owner, but uh, I did not want to leave here, so this opportunity arose. Uh, so I didn't have to leave home looking for work, so we bought the store, and I knew nothing about it. So if you're ever passing through Kitwanga, make sure to stop by the Kitwanga General Store and stock up with what you need. I'm Garrett Perry. Much love.